Yo, what is good YouTube? Welcome back to TS Blur. Today, I'm going to be doing a video that y'all have requested for so long and I'm finally doing it and that is how to take the orange tip off your airsoft gun. Before we get into this, I just want to say I would not recommend taking off the orange tip off your airsoft gun. It is the only thing that can really identify an airsoft gun and a real gun so i would recommend you guys not take off your orange tips but if you guys want to and so please this video is going to teach you how uh it's not illegal or anything so you're not breaking any laws by doing so so yeah i just wanted to say that before we get started i would not recommend it for your safety to take off the orange tips but with that being said let's get straight into it so all airsoft guns are different with the orange tips there's a lot of different ways that companies put on the orange tips so there's a whole bunch of different ways you're gonna have to take it off this depends on what type of orange tip your gun has on it the first and easiest way to take off an orange tip and if your airsoft gun has this type of orange tip is literally just to screw it off um there might be some glue on the threads of the orange tip um, on the outer barrel, but if you need to do so just grab some pliers and rip it off But sometimes the orange tip on your airsoft gun might just be Held on by the threads from the outer barrel So all you would have to do is simply screw it off and if you haven't tried this yet I don't know what you're doing But I just wanted to say that in case you haven't tried it yet that you can just screw it off like this on this one the PLR 16 it literally just had threads uh, that kept on the orange tip so try that first before anything else now if there's glue on the threads holding on the orange tip from you simply just screwing it off all you would have to do really is just fasten your gun to something hold it really tightly and get something like this just any sort of pliers and then you would just squeeze very tightly and twist lefty loosey of course and do it as hard as possible it might be really tough and it might feel like you're gonna break something but you know sometimes they just have really strong glue on the threads of the airsoft gun now if you have something like this as you can see this is a pistol desert eagle a spring pistol and it has an orange tip but as you can see there's nowhere to really access the orange tip or anything like where you could screw it and this gun doesn't have any threads with this, if you wanna get rid of the orange tip, my best suggestion for you is to just find some nail polish. Black nail polish, of course, and all you would have to do is just paint onto the orange tip over it. This is the best way of getting rid of the orange tip, especially if, this is, if it's not an obnoxious orange tip that's huge and it just looks part of the barrel like this one. All you'd have to do is just paint over it with black or you could do a sharpie or just any sort of paint but i found that nail polish works the best and it is easy to remove if you wanted to re remove the paint in a later time uh i did this with one of my glocks so as you guys can see on this glock 42 i literally just um painted the orange tip it was a metal orange tip i'm sure you guys remember but all i had to do was just paint over it with nail polish and if i wanted to remove it at any point i would just get some nail polish remover and then just remove it that way but it did a pretty good job i'm not gonna lie it looks pretty clean the only part is as you can see on the inner barrel you still can see some orange uh on the inside but i mean whatever it's it's a pretty good job so you guys can try that as well if you don't want to actually remove the orange tip and just paint over it it doesn't look that bad either so yeah if you have one like this like on the desert eagle you literally all you have to do is just paint around it just paint, just paint over it with the nail polish. Very easy, very simple. Do a good job, go slow, unlike me right now. But yeah, I mean, it does a really good job. Uh, the nail polish is pretty, uh, you know, it's not very transparent, so you can't see the orange tip. You might have to do a few layers, but you know, it gets it pretty dark. Here, I'll do it real quick for you guys and show you guys the end result on this Desert Eagle. Okay guys, so here is my final result after only about two minutes of painting it with nail polish. Uh, yeah, so it actually doesn't look too bad and you guys could probably do a better job than I can. Uh, you guys probably take a lot longer than me at painting this and be more careful, but you know, it doesn't look too bad. And uh, I recommend this a lot. Uh, you just have to wait for it to dry and uh, be careful. Take your time if you want it to look good. Now, this is probably what you guys are wondering about is airsoft pistols. They are probably the hardest to get the orange tip off because a lot of them do not feature any uh threads and they're just on there so if you want to get the orange tip off of these uh first i would try 
just literally grabbing it out i mean i think it's glued in there but okay so i was able to twist off part of it but let's see how hard this is actually going to be because i know there's going to be some orange tips left still in the barrel which actually might not be that bad if you guys don't care honestly me i don't really care as long as there's not a protruding orange tip but as you can see there i very easily just took off the outer part of the orange tip now the inner part is still in there and it's probably glued in there so we're gonna have to try some other things and take apart this gun to actually get the orange tip out so to do that what you guys are gonna want to do is take off the slide so there's a part right here this part pops out uh, i forgot what it's called but on this side you can see there's a little pin there and you gotta push it out um, i'm gonna go get a mallet and a little piece to push it out easily and we'll work from there okay so as you guys can see this part came off now what you're gonna want to do now is just rack the slide back forward and then you can take off the upper of the pistol now you are left with something like this once you have this slide off it's going to be a lot easier to just get the orange tip out because now you don't have the lower and you can just see the inside of the orange tip now so what you can do is try to ply it out with some pliers these might be a little bit too thick uh to pull out the orange tip we're now probably going to try some smaller tools to get out the last remaining pieces of the orange tip which i'm just going to look for around my house this is becoming more of a challenge than i thought i'm trying to just pin out the edges of this orange tip to try to remove it but man it is glued in there and that's how a lot of airsoft companies have their orange tips is they glue in the inner side of the orange tip and just relieve uh the outer part which we already took off as you can see but the inside still has glue on it so you're gonna have to work on this for a while if you want to get it completely out okay so i'm actually making progress with this little screwdriver with a flat head uh attachment and i'm literally just prying out piece by piece of this orange tip very so carefully and slowly but it is working and i'll get back to you guys when i'm done okay wow so that wasn't that hard that only took about five minutes and literally i just went around all the edges of the orange tip and just pried it off and once it pried off it was pretty easy to just take out the whole thing uh so yeah if you have something like this it's going to be very easy to do so just get a small screwdriver with one of these flat head attachments and you're just going to want to pry the edges of the orange tip off very carefully and slowly and you just can take it all out very easily if you can do so you just got to get in between the edges of the orange tip and the outer barrel uh and then you just pry out uh pry out and then inwards and it will just come off uh, as you guys can see i did a pretty decent job of getting all the orange tip off and it looks very clean now the boom there you guys go we have a very very clean 2011 now without an orange tip and it just looks so much better now uh, a lot you know that without the protruding orange tip it looks very clean and uh, i actually did a pretty good job at this so that's pretty much all i have for today guys i hope i helped you guys with this video if i did make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe but yeah i would say we didn't do a bad job today i mean uh, everything worked out uh, let me know if you guys try these uh, methods in the comments down below as well and i hope that i can help you guys out thank you guys so much for watching this has been ts blur and peace out youtube